someone sitting behind me who's like coughing or sneezing. Up. Let me show you what this seat is like, what the service is like, the food you get with Qantas on their A330 business class from Brisbane to Japan. <laughs> Good morning, we're in Brisbane. Brisbane. Still. Wait for him to land. Hang on. It's not happening. Why not? What a cool view. So today we're on board a Qantas A330. This is an A330-300 from Brisbane International to Narita in Japan. Just over an eight hour trip, it's gonna be taking us off the coast of Australia, basically over Papua New Guinea, Port Moresby, and then up into Narita in Japan. And then from there, we're gonna be jumping on a train, heading into central Tokyo, spending a night there, then heading to Osaka. I'll tell you about that. But today, I wanna to give you a bit of a look at the A330's business class offering, taking a look at the seat, uh, there should be a meal service coming up later today as well. The in-flight entertainment. Just give you an overview of what to expect if you are going to fly business class on an A330 with Qantas. This service with Qantas on the A330, there's a meal service now, it's about two hours into the flight and we actually got to pre-book, you can pre-book the meal when you're flying in business. Uh, there's about eight or ten options I think if I remember rightly and you can book the basic kind of vegetarian options, there's a few meat dishes, there's a prawn dish, beef dish, but because I'm vegetarian I booked the veggie dishes beforehand. Two courses, first is going to be a pumpkin soup, second one, I can't remember what I booked so it's going to be a surprise to you and me at the same time. here on the Qantas flight as well. Um, first of all, subscribe to the channel, so thank yeah. you Trevor, but also recently subscribed to Nico's channel too. And Trevor's gonna become a pilot as well, yeah? Yeah, one yeah. day soon. I'm gonna uh, get my PPL and uh, 
yeah, buy my own small plane and travel around Australia. See, now we've got that on film, we can all hold into it. So if you see Trevor on the future flight on Qantas and he hasn't learned to fly at that point, you hold him accountable for that. Yes, yeah. fly Qantas. <laughs> It's been ages since we played airplane trivia on this channel and when I say it's been ages we've never done it before so bear with me. Now of course we're on board a Qantas A330 but it's not the most commonly used aircraft that Qantas operate. For one very easy point first of all, what is the most commonly used aircraft that operate that Qantas are using? Yes, of course, that's an easy one. It's the 737. So the second most commonly used aircraft is actually the A330-200, the older variant. They operate 18 of those, and that's not what this is. This is the A330-300, of which Qantas are only currently operating 10. And then for five airplane trivia points outside of the A330 and the 737, what's Qantas's next most commonly, commonly? What's Qantas's next most commonly operated aircraft? They've got 12 of those. Tune in in the next vlog for another episode of Airplane Trivia if I get enough comments down there telling me that it wasn't rubbish. to Narita, Japan, everyone with their local time is coming up to 5.44 p.m. Oh, that's <laughs> yours. You need that. <laughs> wow, this is phenomenal. This is oh, the place, the yeah, this is the place for the tea and the coffee. <laughs> so we just jumped into the flight deck now. This is the A330 flight deck. This is David. Nice to meet you, David. Good. How are you? Good. First of all, how is the flight for you today, coming in from Brisbane? A uh, bit of weather coming in yeah, the last sort of hour or so. How is it for you bit guys? A bit of weather for the last um, the last oh. hour of the cruise, unfortunately for, for you guys down the back. Um, that was due to some very strong uh, westerly winds, and um, but the approach into here was a little bit bumpy, but it uh, wasn't too bad. The visibility was good. And, yeah. Um, yeah. That was the landing. Not too bad. <laughs> well, who, who did the landing first of all? Yeah. Was it you? Or, yeah, was you it all first yeah, a little bit bumpy, but yeah, not too bad. <laughs> How often do you do this flight? How often are you going between Brisbane and well, Marita? Well, we operate. The Airbus A330, a daily service from Brisbane, and I probably do it maybe oh, at the moment, maybe once every two or three weeks. You were on the 767 before? 767 and yeah. then Jumbo and then, and then um, Boeing 737. Oh. Do you, do you, I know that it's like saying which is your favourite child, but have you got a favourite out of them all that you've flown? Uh, the 767 was, was a magic aeroplane, and mm. you can fill it up with fuel, you can go a long distance, very versatile and you could do auto lands and low visibility and it was just a delightful aircraft to fly. Yeah. And it was the first aeroplane that had the electronic um, screen that displays the EFAS flight decks. Mm. Flight deck. So um, it, it's probably one of my favourites. Now not just yourself in the family who's a pilot, your That's son right. as well. Your son. Yeah, so Joshua, yeah. we were talking before, uh, is a pilot. He fly, he's flying a 152 at the moment. That's right. Which airports are you flying so at? He's learning to fly at Archfield in Brisbane. and. Uh, learning with uh, Southern Skies Aviation. Yeah. And he's just gone solo a couple of weeks ago, so we're very proud of him. Yeah. Awesome. All right, so Joshua, if you're watching this, first of all, congratulations on your first solo. You'll never forget it. It's an amazing experience. Well done. Um, I think, is he asp aspiring to fly for Qantas as well? He certainly is. All right, and you two could fly together at some point. Yeah, that, that would be, cool. be our, that would be That's our dream. That's your dream. Yeah. All right, so if there's a father-son flight, Joshua, with you and your dad, I have to be on that plane. <laughs> I have to be a passenger on that plane. I'd love to do it. Look, good luck with your flight training and thank you for the, um, supporting the channel as well. And thanks for letting us up here in your cockpit. Nice thanks welcome. for bringing us to Tokyo yeah. as well. Yeah, no worries. Appreciate yeah. that. Thanks thank very you. much. Thank you so okay. much. Cheers. It's so Cheers. lovely to meet you. This is amazing. I think milkshake is quite comfortable here. <laughs> milkshake's had an upgrade as well. <laughs>